Counter-Strike 1.6's golden time is long over. Many players moved to Source and nowadays Global Offensive. When Counter-Strike Source was released, people were happy to see all the improvements after the disappointing Source release of Half-Life 1, which was a simple portation of the original to the Source engine without noteworthy improvements. That led to the creation of Black Mesa Source, but that's a different story for another day. Today's topic is what Counter-Strike Source was not a Counter-Strike 1.6 port to the Source engine. When looking at it for the first time, you might think, this is just regular good old Counter-Strike 1.6. But as soon as you see the water or take a look at the options in the graphics menu, you'll realize it is the Source engine. Hmm, we haven't used our counter-terrorist Fox mascot for a while. <laughs> brilliant. Gameplay-wise, this port is very close to the original classic Counter-Strike. But unlike normal 1.6, it includes bots. And other than the leaked build of Counter-Strike Source, this Source build of Counter-Strike includes a working tactical shield. So far I didn't get the opportunity to test this build stability on a LAN party, but with my desktop and laptop connected on a local server it worked fine. So if you wanna go and play some classic Counter-Strike and don't want to spend money on it, this port is for you. Even though this portation is fun to play, it does have some issues, most of which are minor. The water and the bot navigation doesn't work on every map. Also, hostage rescue zones don't work every time and probably the most annoying thing are some issues with hitboxes, though that doesn't occur very often. What is kind of funny is the fact that you can pick up a shield when you are already carrying a primary weapon. Kind of makes you feel like an uber soldier. Some of these issues can be a bit annoying, but when you manage to play with human players, none of these issues should be a game breaker. Otherwise, when playing with bots, you'll be facing some very competent opponents from time to time. <laughs> Idiots. But all in all, very fun to play and actually very well made. And just in case you might ask, yes, it is possible to import Counter-Strike Source maps and it should be also possible to do it the other way around. Counter-Strike 1.6 Source is the work of the Russian modder Nikolai Aulov and is available for download on his channel. You'll find the link to his work in the description down below or in the little info thing up here in the right corner. Check his stuff out, he does some very interesting work. And just in case he ever sees this video, Gaspardian Arlov, Molodyets, Dirigite Yevo. Oh god, I think I messed it up totally. So, nonetheless, see you guys next time. Till then, have a nice day and as always, goodbye and guten Tag.